g'day from us on Anacam. Here is a little sneak peek at what is to come in the next video. Okay, the five gentlemen that came on board your vessel. Can you yeah, recall that one for yeah, us? Yeah, well that was, a, that was a different situation. We, the, we were on the way back up being six weeks or so late in our crossing and the tides had gone against us and the winds had gone against us and we found ourselves in the Solomon Sea in the middle of a storm right on the nose spending three days ho hove to uh, within sight of the problem Hogan solved. solved it was okay to go in there so we went in the Hoganville and within a matter of a few hours instead of bouncing up and down in the middle of the Solomon Sea we were anchored behind a beautiful little sand we didn't bay. see any people which was strange because we'd been used to people calling by wanting to trade. But the people that went past just ignored us, you know, <clears throat> they'd go past in the canoe, canoes and stuff and they just wouldn't even look at us, which was most unusual. Yeah. They'd all be waving normally and stuff. And Nine o'clock on anyway, that was Wednesday night, a boat came and the response side. was, hey, I had a bunch of machine guns poking in my head, in my face, and we're going to kill you. The guns pointing at me, oh, it's not a gun, it's not a gun. <laughs> 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 she did. <laughs> we were going to be killed. Yeah, didn't think it was going to no, first came on board, I thought, yeah, this is the end. I said goodbye to Baz. <laughs> the full video will be coming up in a few days' time. As Roz and Baz recount their time, they were attacked by five machine gun-wielding pirates.